Uh, so listen, we're gonna do uh, we're gonna do a couple of moments from this show. Uh, as you heard, it is uh, it is a musical that takes place in uh, New Jersey high school, and it's about this kid, uh, Jeremy here, who's gonna be played by Will. Um, and Jeremy is just like the least special kid of all time. There is nothing remarkable about him. He's not even special enough to be like a loser. You know, he's just the most normal, could not be more average, unsparkly kid of all time. Um, and, <laughs> and the show is sort of about what, what happens to him when uh, some technology intersects with his life. Uh, but what we're gonna do first is we're gonna give you a taste of the opening number. Now the opening number is a really long song. It involves like a million actors. Um, and we obviously don't have that today. And so, um, so like I said, Will's gonna play Jeremy and then myself and Eric are gonna be the, uh, like the kids at school. Uh, so this is just a taste of this, this number. This is how the show opens. And when the show opens, the curtain rises uh, and we see Jeremy at his computer really into something. It's clearly something very important is going on. He's staring at his computer and this is what happens. Come on, come on, go, go. Come on, come on, go, go. I'm waiting for my porno to load. My brain is gonna freaking explode. And now, of course, it's time to hit the road, which means I'll be uncomfortable all day. But that really isn't such a change. If I'm not feeling weird or super strange, my life would be in utter disarray. Cause freaking out is my okay. Good morning, time to start the day. C -c -c come on, C -c -c come on, go, go. C -c -c come on, C -c -c come on, go, go. Now should I take a bus or walk instead? I feel my stomach filling up with dread. When I get nervous, my whole face goes red. Dude, weigh the options calmly and be still. Junior on the bus is killer weak. But if I walk when I arrive, I'm gonna straight up reek. And my boxers will be bunchy and my pits will leak. Oh God, I wish I had the skill to just be fine and cool and chill. I don't wanna be a hero. Just wanna stay in the line. I'll never be a Rob De Niro. For me, Joe Pesci is fine. And so I follow my own rules and I use them as my tools to stay alive. I don't wanna be special, no, no. I just wanna survive. C -c -c come on, C -c -c come on, go, go. C -c -c come on, C -c -c come on, go, go. Never gonna be the cool guy. I'm more the one who's left out of all the characters at school. I am not the one who the story's about. Why can't someone just help me out and teach me how to thrive? I'm just trying my best to pass the test and come on, come on, go, go, come on, come on, go, 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 Thanks. Thanks, guys. Um, how's the balance, by the way? Can we hear words? Can we hear the piano? Everything yeah. okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. great, sweet. Um, so, uh, so that's the opening. Uh, obviously, Jeremy's not in a good place. Uh, basically, what happens is Jeremy finds out that there are these things called squips. Uh, that's squip, rhymes with quip. 
Um, and a SQUIP is this uh, tiny supercomputer. Uh, it's made in Japan, naturally. And the supercomputer is put inside a pill. And he finds out that teenagers all over New Jersey are taking this pill, this SQUIP, and the supercomputer implants in their brain, and then it tells them what to do. It tells them how to behave. Uh, so, you know, Jeremy sort of hears about this, and he goes uh, to the Menlo Park Mall, and he goes uh, to, to sort of illicitly buy a squip uh, in the back of a Payless shoes store, obviously, which is where you buy things. Um, and so this, uh, you're going to see a little bit of what happens when Jeremy gets his squip uh, and decides to take it in the middle of the mall, uh, and this is, this is what happens. Yeah. Ah! Accessing neural memory, accessing muscle memory, access procedure complete. Jeremy here. Welcome to Squip 2.0. You look like Keanu Reeves. My default mode. You can also set me for Sean Connery, Jack Nicholson, sexy anime female. <laughs> No, Keanu's pretty good. Can everyone see you? I exist only in your mind. All they can see is you having an animated conversation with yourself. So don't do that. Just think at me like you're telepathic. Like in X-Men? I can see this is going to be difficult. Some squips only have to memorize numbers or overcome a stuttering problem. You, however, are going to require a complete behavioral overhaul. Mm -hmm. You want to be more chill. You mean cool. I do not. <laughs> we only use squip approved vernacular. Now, the change that you desire is going to be complex and em implementing it will be hard, but it is also simple. Human social activity is governed by certain rules. I have the processing capacity to understand those rules and pass them on to you. Take your hands out of your pockets. Arch your back, puff out your chest. Add some swagger to your gait, or you'll look like a master bait, or fix your posture, then the rest. But I am a master We'll bait. fix that. All your nerdiness is ugly. All your stammering's a chore. Every lame characteristic makes you come off as autistic. We'll fix your vibe and then some more. Oh, everything about you is so terrible. Oh, everything about you makes me want to die. Jesus. So don't freak out. Don't resist and have no doubt if I assist you will be more chill. So, ow! Jeez, did you just shock me? Spinal stimulation. You were slouching. Okay, so. hmm. I feel gay. I should be so lucky. If you were, this would be a whole lot easier. First how, things how first, go buy a new shirt. What? Wait, what's wrong with my shirt? It's better if you just comply. My job's to color your aesthetic and make you seem much less pathetic. So step and fetch, don't ask me why. Pick that one. It has a picture of Eminem on it. If you're so astute, what do you need me for? Look, Jeremy, if this is going to work, you can't just listen to me. You have to obey. Now repeat after me. Oh, everything about you is so terrible. Everything about me is just terrible. Good. Oh, everything about you makes me want to die. Everything about me makes me want to die. Now you've got it. But Jeremy, soon. We 
love everything about you. Everything about you is going to be so alive. We could never live without you. You won't feel left out or unsure. You won't be ugly anymore because everything about you is going to be cool and powerful and popular, incredible. You will be more chill. Chill. Be more chill. Be more chill, be more chill, be more chill. Thanks, guys.